This is called Devil's Hole. Not sure it was worth the trip, but there's some interesting hiking along the way. Bunch of rocks. Well, like old riverbeds that dried up or something. I guess maybe when there's flash floods or something. But yeah, it's just basically it just seems like a typical stream. But yeah, there's a lot of rocks around. Uh, maybe, I guess people were coming back. They were swimming in it during the day. I was told it gets up to seven feet deep, but I don't know. Slippery rock in North Carolina might be better, which is probably not too far from here. But yeah, you got to take, uh, it's hard to find because you don't get GPS signal on your cell phone a lot. And I guess this is probably not a C note because maybe it's man made from uh, mining. I don't know. Or maybe it is natural. Yeah, this is the little stream that fills it up. The devil's bathtub. I will not be making a deal with the devil today. Or it could be the John the Baptist Baptist hole. But yeah, to find it, you gotta take the maps to Devil's Hole, and then you take it about a mile and a half. Well, no, you, you take it past where the map says, follow the, the, the uh, rocky road, and you take it to the end, and there'll be a parking lot. And then this is like, they say it's just over a mile and a half, but I don't know. It seemed like it took quite a bit, but yeah, I would say maybe it's closer to two miles. It takes a good 45 minutes at least to get here from the trailhead. We have my friends sleeping in the car, waiting on me. We were trying, we went to another park in Southwest Virginia. We're close to the, the uh, Tennessee border. Um, we went to another park called the Channel State Park, but apparently we entered the back way, which doesn't connect to the front way, which is like, I guess, the more touristy area. And so we didn't end up seeing the sights because we spent our time back there and didn't see any, anybody for four hours. <laughs> so. But yeah, it's, uh, this used to be coal mining in this area, I guess in the 1920s they had agriculture here, in the 1940s they had some coal mining, and they had like five-man teams and like a, a pony pulling a cart. 